Hello. Welcome back to our YouTube channel, DK Biosolutions. In the previous video, we learned about genera Euglena and Amoeba. In this video, we will learn about protozoan animals belonging to the genus Paramecium. Paramecium is a genus of unicellular, single-celled, ciliated protozoa. On the body surface, they possess thousands of cilia, a characteristic of Paramecium. It is a common freshwater, marine, and brackish water organism. It is often very abundant in stagnant water bodies. In laboratories, teachers and students have widely used it to study biological processes because some species are easy to cultivate and can be easily induced to conjugate and divide. The name Paramecium, in Greek, paramex, meaning oblong, was coined in 1752 by the English microscopist John Hill. Further, we will look into the scientific classification and examples of paramecium. Paramecium also belongs to the domain eukaryota because a nucleus is present in the cell body. Further in classification, it belongs to kingdom protista. Phylum ciliophora, Class oligohymenophoria. Order paniculida. Family Paramecidae Because members of this family have differentiated anterior and posterior regions and are bounded by a rigid but elastic pellicle. And Genus Paramecium There are four common species of Paramecium. Paramecium caudatum Paramecium aurelia Paramecium trichium And Paramecium woodruffi Now we will see the distinctive features of Paramecium. Species of Paramecium range in size from 50 to 330 micrometers in length. The body is typically ovoid, elongated, and foot-shaped. The body's or cell cytoplasm is enclosed in a pellicle. The pellicle consists of an outer plasma membrane, inner epiplasm, and alveoli layer. The pellicle is elastic and gives the body its definite but changeable shape. Cilia originate from the depressions in the pellicle and cover the whole cell surface. The function of cilia is for locomotion and also to take nutrient-rich water inside the pharynx. Protoplasm is granular and divided into outer ectoplasm and inner endoplasm. Trichocysts act as defensive organ and are present in the ectoplasm. Paramecia contain one or two micronuclei and one macronucleus. Micronuclei have diploid chromosomes and take part in reproduction. Macronuclei take part in the regulation of critical metabolic activities and growth. The macronucleus has multiple copies of the genetic material, that is, polyploid. Contractile vacuoles perform osmoregulation and expel the additional absorbed water. Coordinated movement of cilia helps paramecium to engulf food, and then the food vacuoles digest it. Undigested food is discarded through the anal pore, which is present on the ventral surface in the posterior half of the cell known as cytoproct or cytopege. The most common and well-known species of the genera Paramecium is Paramecium caudatum. In the following video, we will learn about the museum study of the protozoan unicellular animal, Plasmodium.